Hello, my name is Simone Lawrence, superstar linebacker, and I'm here to settle some football debates. I would rather play in snow any time of the day over rain. It's a little bit more fun. I'm not a meteorologist, but I tend to notice when it snows, it's not as cold outside, and the flurries don't bother me as much. Ball security is a lot easier in the snow than in the rain. Especially up here in Canada, the ball gets stickier. I need some kind of sleeves. I don't got no meat on my bones. I went sleeveless for the game against Edmonton where it was like negative two, and I was sick for like a month. I definitely ain't nothing like Kenny Lawler. I did the hoodie before and I lost in the playoffs, so I ain't doing that again. And I'm a dog, so I'm just going no sleeves. Nah, I'm a Viking. No sleeves, that's the way it goes. Probably the waggle just for me. The rouge is pretty sick too. That waggle put defense in a weird spot. I hate the waggle. <laughs> I play defense. I hate the waggle. These guys are running full speed. Uh, you know, I'm a speed guy, so I'll be using it to my advantage. Now, I'm going to say the rouge because you can't make fair catches, and I think it's sick because you got to return every kick. Uh, man, just something about that black, man. Just a little bit of intimidation. I always wanted one of those Meritant visors. This is Meek Mill bar. It says when people hate, they see themselves. So, like, anytime hate, that somebody's hate, all they see is themselves. And they're like, yeah, Yo, you hate it on yourself, bro. We get fined if we wear, like, a colored one. But some dudes just eat the fine. Oh my gosh, I definitely gotta go drums. You eat drums, then you don't know how to eat a chicken wing correctly. I still don't know the trick with flats yet. It takes a little bit more professionalism. It is what it is, you know, take it how you want it. When I call the pizza place, I say, yo, when you make them wings, give me as many flats as possible, please. I like drums, but I like flats more. Oh, that was tough. Oh no. Paul Crew is crazy though, man. Both are epic. We gotta go Willie Beavis. Just because it's just, it's too legendary. Come on, man. I need to throw up. Yeah, I need that any given Sunday swag. You need to set the standard, set a trend. Yo, he killed that role. Like, I literally thought Jamie Foxx could play football. It was so specific. It was scary. Like, yo, that's like a lot of quarterbacks. Like, they tapped in too deep. It got a little nervous. Ooh, Coach Gaines was fire at Friday Night Lights. I felt that. I gotta go Friday Night Lights just because that was when I was growing up. I saw Friday Night Lights in the theaters before Friday Night Game, my dad, and that was a big one for me. But that any given inch by inch, just hearing that, I get the little tingles in the back of my bald head. The seriousness, and then like the music in the background just getting you amped up, you know what I'm saying? Ain't nothing like that Al Pacino speak. Al Pacino, just because I like his name. LL Cool J definitely set it off at the end when he was like, I didn't want you to be the only coach with a punk in your head. So I put the jersey on the shoulder pads, then put the shoulder pads on. I'm pretty sure Don Jackson does it the other way. I hate whenever he does that. Act, I think Act caught me in like the worst day, putting on shoulder pads really, really, really hard. But most of the time, I'm gonna try to just have that jersey on the pads first, just to make it a little easier, because you're kind of tripping if you do it the other way. I got people to help me put that on. I definitely cannot get it on on my own. The jersey's on the pads beforehand and gets slid on with a little, little help. I like the home jerseys. I love the away jerseys. I'm really good with whatever. Home, man, that black is crazy. Black Mafia, Black Mob, man, for real. Are you guys wearing homes on, on Sunday? Yes, we are. Ooh, yes, we nice. are. Black Mob, man, Black Mafia. What's going on? It's Willie Jefferson, number five of the Winnipeg Blue Bombers, and I'm here to settle some football debates. Oh, snow all day. I, I love when it's cold outside. Snow every time. With the snow, you're not getting wet. No, nobody wants to wear wet clothes. Shoes weighing like 10 pounds because of all the water. The rain just makes you heavy, man. Gloves get all wet. I can't catch the ball. Snow, and we just go out there and play like a regular day. Best thing is when you see the linebackers for the play just shivering up in, in cold and they got their hands in their pockets and you know, you know it's gonna be a good day. I think I'd rather play in snow. It makes me feel like a kid again. It's a lot of fun. I'll go sleeveless up to a certain point. I like to have a lot of swag. When the cold weather come out, I want to be one of the guys at the front with no sleeves. Naturally really hot. Feel more comfortable when I wear no sleeves. I always wear the same thing, half sleeves and rain or snow. It's hard, you know? My pants are so tight, I can barely put a tight shirt on. If I can put a hoodie on, that'll be pretty sweet. Kind of jealous of those little guys, man. It's like going to Walmart. I can't find anything my size. Whatever he wears, as long as he catches the ball properly and makes plays for us, it doesn't matter to me. It looks really good on Kenny Lawler. You liked it with the hood on the bag? Yeah. yeah. It was dope. The hoodie might make another appearance. You don't know. I don't know yet. It's a game dying decision. Easy. It's easy. It's the waggle. That's what makes this league unique. Man, that's an advantage. If y'all don't know how hard it is to guard someone moving full speed on a waggle, once you be able to freak your little waggle. I love hitting the waggle. I've been hitting the waggle since, you know, university, high school. The Rouge definitely keeps the game interesting, though. Once the Americans come up here, it's, it's a weird thing for them to kind of get a hold of, but it really opens the field up, and uh, I gotta love the waggle. I think the Rouge just throws such a wrench into strategy, you know, being a head coach and, you know, having those conversations with the special teams coordinator is really something that makes this, this game beautiful. Probably go with the Rouge.
I just had this debate the other day. I'm probably more of a drums though. They just feel like there's more meat. You know, they're easier to eat. I know a lot of people like their flats. Flats, one bite, pull both bones out. No, we don't do drums. I don't know what it is with them flats though. That's just crazy. It's like that flavor on that flat. It just tends to be a little juicier, a little more succulent. Man, I like any wings. I don't care if drums or flats. I don't discriminate. Lemon pepper stepper. You already know it. I think it's like spicy Korean. I'm a big barbecue fan. I like buffalo sauce. Yeah, that thing fire. That is a debate for sure. When we were in college, somebody put it on the speakers and it was just the weirdest vibe. I actually listen to that before my games now. As we get fired up, help those tears roll before the game. I'd probably go with the Friday Night Lights one. Gotta stay true to Texas. Coach games and Friday Night Lights. Both those movies hit me in a different way. The inches we need are everywhere around us. I mean, any given Sunday, that's the legendary speech right there. It's my favorite movie. I used to play hockey back in the day. We would always play that speech before we go into the ice. You know there's some attachments there. Oh man, that's tough. I'm gonna go Steven. I gotta say Willie Beaton, man. I can't hate like that. Willie Beaton. So I'm gonna go with Adam. Anything he does, I love. I'm still a water boy, my mama said. I'm probably gonna go with Willie Beaton. He proved to be a much more dynamic athlete. I don't know though, cause Crew, he was a little sellout. I'm never selling out for my dog. Steven Willie Beaton, baby, you already know what it is. I remember being the young guy, the old guy not really liking him much, and yeah, it's all good. I go gold visors, Winnipeg Blue Bombers, gold helmet, gold visors. I feel like the color visor is a little excessive for me, so. Royal blue kind of tinted visor, because we got them gold helmets. That look hard. Some guys have some pretty cool color visors. I think that's a little too swagger for me. We won some big games in those white jerseys, and we're wearing them on Sunday, so I got to go with the whites. Away. You got a target on your back. White jerseys feel like putting a white sack over a garbage can. It just feels like a, just shows all the bad bodies, the white jerseys. I hate the white jerseys. You can't hide anything you ate the day before in a white jersey.